You're never gonna make it, you're not good enough There's a million other people with the same stuff You really think you're different, man, you must be kidding Think you're gonna hit it, but you just don't get it It's impossible, it's not probable, you're irresponsible Too many obstacles, you gotta stop it, yo You gotta take it slow, you can't be a pro Don't waste your time no more Who the fuck are you to tell me what to do? I don't give a if you say you disapprove I'm gonna make my move, I'm gonna make it soon And I'll do it cause it's what I wanna do Cause all these opinions and all these positions They come in in millions, they block in your vision But no, you can't listen, that it is all fiction Cause you hold the power it as long as you're trying to It is the next day here and... Kyle Disman from Elizabeth, Pennsylvania will be here within the next five to 10 minutes here to pick up his 2004 59 Cummins that comes with $5,000 in cash. So join us today as he picks up his truck. He literally bought a hoodie, not this exact one, but he bought one of our hoodies. He's getting a freaking truck. It's pretty sick. And do not forget guys that you can actually get entered to win this beautiful 1990 12 out Cummins first gen. That also comes with $5,000 in cash and the giveaway for this truck ends on March 19th. So that is coming up very quickly. Today when I'm recording this, it is March 3rd on the 19th. The giveaway for this truck is over, which is pretty much two weeks, almost exactly. So take advantage of it while you can. Hit the link in the description below, place an order at lmpgear.com or on our app. We're actually running a huge promo on our app right now. So you can actually go to the website and there's quick download links for Apple and Android users. So whatever phone you got, we got an app for you. If you just go to the website, click download our app, download whichever one you need, and you can get our app and then uh, get a huge bonus entry opportunity when you purchase on our app only until Sunday afternoon, which I believe will be tomorrow afternoon. So take advantage of that while you can. But back to the third gen here, I'm gonna do a small recap on this truck since it has been some time since we went over this thing. And we did have pretty much everything listed on the site that has been done to this truck. We've got some 20 by 10 method race wheels here with some 35 by 12 and a half wide Venom Power Terra Hunter MT tires. We bought these, of course, both the tires and the wheels brand new. I literally washed this thing so thoroughly yesterday and as soon as I get home, even trying to avoid the dirt. I mean, it's just, yeah, our driveway needs some work. 5% tint all the way around with a 5% brow on the front. On the top, like 30% of the windshield. Pretty stinking dark. This thing does have a full fourth gen Laramie interior swap suede headliner with the starlit function. It's got the switch and the remote up there to control the colors and choices with the starlit headliner. It's beautiful. It does have a matte black wrap on the top of the cab. It kind of actually ties in with that tint and flows right on over through, but it also helps with sun fading on the top of the truck. Everybody knows the tops of the trucks, the top of the cab. If you've had a pickup truck, an old one especially, you know that the tops of the cabs always seem to fade before anything else. We have Alpha Rex headlights in the front, projector style with LED tail lights in the rear. We've got the charcoal gray color coding here. Paint match rear bumper, paint match front bumper. This thing is pretty sick. It is leveled in the front and it does have the traction bars. I think it's pretty sick. It's ready to go. As far as I was told, according to this thing in terms of power, there's really nothing done to it other than a lift pump. But I find that so hard to believe because when I've driven this thing, when you get into the pedal, this thing, uh, it doesn't feel like it's stock with a lift pump. It feels like it's got a lot more power than that, but that's what I was told and I ran with that because if that's what I'm told, that's the only thing I can, I can relay in terms of information. But then again, maybe the guy I got it off of had no idea what the previous owner before him did. And so he just said, as far as he knows, it's stock. But I think it actually got a decent amount of power. I believe he's pulling up now. Dude, Kyle. Thank you. Welcome. Oh. There's your truck, dude. Wow. And the hoodie that won the truck. <laughs> yeah. Isn't that just wild? A single hoodie. A piece of clothing, get a pickup yeah. truck. Dude, we've never done a setup like that, and I'm like, ah, I'm like, bronze? I don't know. I just watched that video, like, when you were talking about the tires yeah. and everything. They look so good. I love a nice setup. Yeah, I had, I had been so torn on it, because we'd never done that color on a truck ever. And then I looked up some pictures, I'm like, charcoal third gens with bronze wheels. And there actually was a guy that has, like... He's yeah, actually got a YouTube that, channel. That truck looked exactly the same. I know. Other than he's got the newer front end, like the 06. It looked, I was like, that color looks so good with those wheels. I'm like, I got to do bronze wheels on this thing. Sweet. 
you've been here trying to embrace the moment a little bit. What are your final thoughts here with your truck? What's going through your head, the process of how you want it? I mean, honestly, I just still can't believe it. <laughs> I don't know. It's hard. I'm speechless, honestly. I believe it. I believe it. So you said that you were a little skeptical at first. For, for good very, reason, for good reason. Very skeptical. At first. So what was kind of your process of how you found out that it was not a scam when he called you? What were kind of the steps that you took just to help somebody else out here if they're getting a random phone call? So I got message. a random phone call. They called me three times and then I answered the fourth. He was telling me that I won the truck and everything like that. And I didn't believe it. I didn't believe him. Yeah. So I emailed your company yeah yeah and that's how that's how it gave me hope to find out like that it actually was true you said you I saw mean, the stuff on the website that kind of helped yeah you, that, like... that website stuff definitely did help after you actually called me then i was like wow this is crazy heck yeah dude <laughs> heck yeah it, honestly it still doesn't feel real <laughs> Are you going to modify it and do anything crazy with it or what? I mean, I don't think I'm going to change a single thing to the outside. Okay. Okay. I respect that. I mean, I wouldn't be offended if you said you didn't like it, but I mean, no, it's your truck. I love, it. I love the way it looks. Okay, cool. One last look. One last handshake. Thank you. Congrats again. Enjoy the truck. I will. Let me know if you need anything. The zoom on that iPhone is pretty freaking wild, but anyways, guys, he got his truck. He seems happy. Kyle, I hope you enjoy that truck for as long as you keep it. And again, thank you guys so much for all of your support, being able to do this. Couldn't do it without you guys. Feel free to enter to win this thing. Our big app bonus does end on Sunday, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. One of you will soon be taking this truck home, just like Kyle just took that one. Peace.